The video we're about to show you may be triggering. It's video inside of a Chicago lift late one night last month. It all starts normally. There's a woman slouched in the back seat, but look closely, she's whispering to somebody on her phone. And what you can't see is another passenger lying on the floor of the car. And that's when things go off the rails. Within 30 seconds, an SUV pulls up beside the lift and opens fire <coughs> directly into the lift. Go! Go! Hurry up, drive! Thankfully, the gunfire didn't hit anyone in the car. The quick thinking driver calls for help but the SUV tails them as they drive through the south side of Chicago. And then things get even crazier. As the driver pulls over, the passengers bail and a group of men start attacking the driver, punching him over and over before trying to pull him from the car. Luckily, he was able to speed off with down your hair. Where's dad? I don't know. Only blown out windows and a badly beaten face. That 52 year old driver is still recovering and the police are investigating. The driver said he's planning to file a lawsuit against Lyft, saying they didn't do enough to help him in this crazy situation. Lyft says safety is fundamental to them and they're cooperating with the. Shalom, Shalom, call her law, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. That's giving all praise to the Most High, name is only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Abar from the Prophets in Babylon, camp down here in Tampa, Florida. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone who taught us his truth and truth and sincerity. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered abroad. All right. In this video, man, you see, man, a lot of judgments been going out lately. You see that we are in a different world, okay, than the world that we were in a couple years ago, man. Okay, and as you see in this video, you know, this man, you know, this this guy was, you know, he was just at work, you know, he was working, you know, been a Lyft driver, and all of a sudden they start shooting at his car, shooting into his car, trying to kill the, kill, you know, kill the passengers in his car, all right, and, you know, this just goes to show you the times that we in, man, the scriptures talk about measure the times diligently, you know, and when you start seeing these things come to pass, you know, you should know what time we in, what spirit you should be in. All right, but I ain't going to make this too long. This is on Ecclesiasticus or Sirach chapter 5, verse 7. Make no tarrying to turn to the Lord and put not off from day to day. So don't be trying to wait and take your time to come back, to, I mean, to, to come to the most high. You know, don't, don't wait and take your time to, especially for you men, to, you know, to start taking this truth seriously and, you know, um, you know, getting more understanding on this thing, watching more videos, you know, reading more. Don't wait and take your time to, you know, you know, uh, pray to the most high and seek him out, you know, and, and you know, you, and really you you should be seeking to do his work, man. You know, it, 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 you know, that, that that's what a true man of the Lord is going to be doing. You ain't going to just know, know you ain't going to be ain't going to be no man that just know you an Israelite and you just sitting on your ass eating potato chips thinking that you're going to make it to the kingdom. And now, hey, the scripture says how um, <clears throat> um, faith without works is dead, man. Okay, so though, though though you may know you were Israelite, you must have the uh, the uh, works to back it up. You see, showing that you believe in this thing. Okay, and and and, and, and if that you're gonna be in these scriptures, you're gonna be studying. You're gonna know what times we in. You are gonna understand these prophecies, and you should be out there prophesying, man. Okay, if the Lord is dealing with you in that spirit, if you ain't, if you can't prophesy, you can hold a you can hold a sign. Okay, you can bring some waters out. Okay, scripture said talk about how um. Um, if you bring a a a, a prophet a, a, a cup of water, roughly paraphrasing, you shall receive a prophet's reward. Okay, but Jake can't even do that. You know, I had a Jake ask me today. You know, um, what he asked me? What he asked me? He said, uh, oh, so is the? He said, oh, so and this Jake know he did know you know about the truth, but he you know he ain't never really, really, really take this thing seriously to actually go out there and teach and stuff. But he asked me, he said, oh, so only the hundred and forty four thousand is going to get to slay you with the Lord for a thousand years? I said. More than likely, <laughs> you know, more than likely, you know, and then he's like, oh, I want to do, I want to do, well, if you want to do this and do that, then you should have been doing this and doing that for the Lord, man. Jake don't come out to the camp. Jake don't, you know, do, you know Jake, you know, hey, man, this thing is deadly serious. And if you can, if you haven't realized that yet, I don't know what to tell you, but it says for suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth and in thy security, when you think you are safe. Thou shalt be destroyed and perish in the day of vengeance. The Lord is coming with vengeance, man. Okay, great death and destruction is coming coming upon this place, and many people are about to to um you know are already you know uh, 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 giving up the ghost, man. The Lord is taking the spirits from many people, man. Okay, 
And that's the judgment of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai because what you people are wicked. You know they thought the Lord, the, the Lord, the Lord just was a joke. You know took him for a game. Okay, and we in a time where now the Lord is, is um going to recompense all you people for all all your judgments, all your slanderings. You see, this man was in a car. Just happened to be in a car with with, with some with some passengers, and they start getting shot at, and he getting his ass beat for whatever the hell they did, man. You see. <laughs> We are in a, um, you know, a, 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 a some serious times, man. Okay, we in some serious times, and if you can't see that by now, it's probably because you're gonna be in it. Okay. <clears throat> Verse twelve: If thou hast understanding, answer thy neighbor. If not, lay thy hand upon thy mouth. So if you have this this truth, this understanding, you should be out there, you know, you know, preaching this word, man, teaching Jake. You know, if you got, even if you got, you know, if you ain't got to have much, if you got a little bit, the basics, go out there and teach the basics. Don't try to go in, don't, don't try to get deep. Back tomorrow. This Edomite right here gives me the chills, man. Some, she, she's just not right. She's just not right, man. <laughs> All right. But, you know, you should be out there teaching. You should be out there, you know, hey, hey let me grab this real quick. Um, verse 15, be not ignorant of anything in a great or small matter or small. So you guys can't be ignorant of these things, man. All, all these things are spiritual, man. Okay. All these things are spiritual. And if you can't see that, because the Lord is not dealing with you on that level, man. <clears throat> Bear with me. Second Timothy chapter four, verse nine. Do thy diligence to come shortly unto me. So you should be doing this thing diligently, man. Doing the due diligence, doing this work. Okay. And then, and, and that way you can cut so that way which you can be what re rekindled with the Lord, you see. But if you just out here playing in La La Land, you know you gonna you know you gonna be you know going about your day one day, and all of a sudden this type of wrath is gonna come upon you, you know. And it could have been way worse for 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 this man. I, we don't know who he was. It said that they didn't identify him, or he didn't want to be identified. But you get the picture, man. Or even the Jakes in the back seat, you know. Those shots could have went off and shot somebody in in, in 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 a car next to them and killed the baby or something, man. Verse ten. Wherefore, the rather brethren give diligence to make thy your, to make your calling and election sure. For if ye do these things, ye shall never fail. So if you really believe in this thing, you are gonna be doing what you gotta do, serving your halbashim y'all shy to um, make your calling and election sure. And if you're not doing these things, then you're going to fail. But if you are, then you will never then, then you shall never fail. Okay, but if you just take this thing for for a joke, for granted, you know we coming into a time where um, <clears throat> you know it's about to get um unbearable out here. And so like, yeah, my throat's all scratchy, man. You know, it's just devil spraying stuff in the air. I just made a couple of posts the other day about all these chemtrails in the air, man. It's so much chemtrails in the air down here, man. It was so much the other day, and I, was, and I, and I actually got pictures of it, just showing they just like blatantly like fucking so overly spraying and shit, and everybody talking about how they sick and stuff. So there you go, man. This man is a damn demon. All right. I'm going to grab this right. I'm going to close out. I ain't going to make this too long. So like, yeah. It says, um, second Ezra chapter nine, verse one. He answered me then and said, measure thou the time diligently in itself. This ain't the time to be out here, you know, in la la land. This ain't the time to be out here thinking that, that, that you can just worship who you want to worship and whatever God you want to worship and do what you, you know, been doing, you know. All this time. No, this is time to be getting serious with yourself and really considering your relationship with the most high. You see? It says, <clears throat> and um, measure thou the times diligently in itself, and when thou seest part of the signs pass, which I have told thee before, which we see in what these prophecies come to pass, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the earth which he made. And how is the Lord visiting this earth, man? Okay, with wrath, great death and destruction, man, vengeance. Okay, he's sending death angels out here, man. Wherefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world, and you're seeing many earthquakes in diverse places, and you're seeing a lot of protests all over the world over this, um, these mandates, man. Okay, then shall thou well understand that the Most High spake of these things from the beginning of the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. And, and that's the truth, man. See, what you Jakes don't realize is, um, you know, and I, like I said, I don't know if this man was a Jake or not, but I'm just, you know, that, you know, I, I, obviously this video, these, these videos are to you Jakes, you know, you so-called um, blacks, Hispanics and Native Indians who are the Israelites. All right. Um, 
See, because the, the reason why we've been out there proclaiming this truth to you and telling you to, to telling you this thing, it wasn't to get your money, okay? It, it, you know, it, it wasn't to, um, you know, to, uh, you know, just to try to, uh, you know, whatever the fuck Jake thought, man. All right, but this is why it says Second Corinth, Second Chronicles, chapter fifteen, verse thirteen, that whosoever would not seek Yahweh, power of Israel, should be put to death. Whether small or great, whether man or woman. So what the times we're coming into, if you haven't sought Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, which is the most high and his only begotten son, um, Yahweh Shai, and, and their true names and the true spirit, you're going to be put to death. Okay, you're going to be getting shot, shot in your car. You're going to be getting chased down the road by SUVs and whatnot, man. You're going to be getting, you know, a, a, a badly um, beat up face. You are about to be judged. The Lord's about to have all hell come upon you, man. All you people, man. And you might not die. You know, right away, you might, you know, be, be getting plagued and, 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 and jacked up for fucking a, a couple months, man, before the Lord ultimately take your ass out. He may have your ass getting jacked up every single day of the rest of your life just to take you out and end by, by that thermo, those thermonuclear missiles, man. And this is why the most high is to be feared. You see, everybody's big and bad and tough and got all this shit to say in this doctrine and that doctrine and this God and that God until all hell breaks loose. Until you got shots being fired in your window and all you thinking about is God help me, God help me. You looking for the true God then. You in that, in, that, in that moment, in that panic, you you will want to hear whatever God, you know, you'll want to hear, you know, you, you will want to hear the truth, man. And it ain't going to be about feelings then because your feelings going to be already hurt. And a lot of you people, you ain't going to realize this until your feelings get ultimately hurt and you might even be losing your lives, man. All right. Truth be told. All right. I just want to make this real quick because I just came across that little, that little story. I just, I, you know, it's just it's an example of the times we in, man. One day you could be at work, whatever you work at, and other motherfuckers start, you know, sh 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 shots start getting sent, you know. And if you ain't been seeking your help, you know, if you ain't been, you know, re re really taking the Lord seriously, giving your all to, to the Lord, what you think the Lord going to do for you, man? Okay. I'm going to grab this last scripture. Um, We went into this the other day, but we're going to again. It says, 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 6. Um, <clears throat> but I this I say, he which soweth sparingly shall reap also sparingly. So if you in this thing, you find out you're Israelite, but you just, you know, half assing and you ain't really giving your all. You know, you ain't really doing your videos. You ain't really, you know, you ain't, you, you ain't never been out the fucking camp. You don't know what the hell going on. You don't know what's going on in the world of Israel. You ain't, you know, defending the, 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 the if you ain't if you don't know what's going on in the world of Israel, you obviously are not defending the gospel. You're not defending the doctrine. You're not defending Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. You see? So you you your ass is lost. I Meaning you are giving, you know, half into this thing. Like if for instance, and you Jake Snow, especially, you know, speaking to, to, to you men first and foremost, and even you women. Whenever you may meet a, you know, uh for for you men, whenever you may meet me a woman. You know, you may meet a fine ass woman. The woman may, 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 may be bad as hell. You're like, damn, she's so fucking fine, man. Oh my God. And you talk to her, you step down on her, and you actually get her number. You know, she want to, you know, talk to you. She want to uh, go, uh, go out, you know, meet or whatever, whatever it may be. And you excited. You're like, oh my God, yeah. You know, all you think about is this damn woman, man. You think about how, how, how good she looked, how she smelled, you know, the whole nine. Your whole mind is, you know, you know, um, um, strapulated around this that the ideal of this woman, and that's really how your mind should be about this truth, man. Which is why wisdom is is, is referred to as a woman. You see, Sophia, because you're supposed to be seeking your help, Hashem Yahweh Shai, man. Lyft says they didn't do enough. The driver said he's playing. That 52 year old driver is good as man. There's bail. And then things get even crazier. As the driver pulls over, the passengers bail, and a, and that UV tail. The quick. Thankfully, the guy. You Within that, 30 man? seconds, an SUV pulls up beside the lift and opens fire <laughs> directly into the lift. Look at that, man. Look like, like, like you got a drum on that bit. You know, a, a, a hundred round clip, you know, the straight death angels, you know, <laughs> seeking to put you to death, man. And whoever the hell that was on the ground, that, that, that nigga knew what was coming, man. You know, he was with his woman. And you and you women that's out here with these damn nigglets, and your ass gonna die with these niggas, man. She go, he on the ground and she she's sitting up in the seat looking scared and shit. You, man, I'm trying to tell you, bro. A lot of y'all ain't going to make it, man. A lot of y'all is not going to fucking make it. You know, y'all ain't going to make it, man. 
he on the damn ground. He, he, you know, he on the floor of the car. You know, he already knew it was coming. He on the floor. And the driver didn't, didn't know what the hell was going on. He, he on the floor of the car. She, she, she crouched down on the phone. Second Corinthians, you know, and 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 they really and all this bullshit, they put his his life in danger. He ain't had nothing to do with that, but 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 he the one catching all the blows. And that's going to show you that you Jake's man, you know, and through the spirit, I believe that this guy had to be an Israelite man, just just how ditzy and retarded he was, you know, sottish, slow, you know, re, you know, stiff neck. Shows you that he had to be a Jake man, cause he didn't know what the hell was going on. He was in La La Land, La La Land, man. That's that's the majority of our people. A majority of our people. Are in fucking you know uh, the, the the damn sunken place right now, man. <laughs> okay, they in a sunken place, and they have no idea what is really going on. That's why every time they people tell them, hey, go, hey, come come up here to this clinic. They going up there and they rolling their sleeves up. Well, they ain't in the clinic. It's the Walgreens parking lot. It's the it's the damn Raymond James Stadium. You know the damn football stadium parking lot and whatnot, man. And you going up there? You got cars lined down the road. Because you people are through, man. You people have been deceived. You people are, you know, just awaiting your death and destruction at this point. <clears throat> verse 6. 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 6. But this I say, he which soweth sparingly shall reap also sparingly. And he which soweth bountifully shall reap also bountifully. Every man according as he purposed in his heart, in his, which means in his mind. So if you come into this thing and you, and you sowing, you know, you, 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 you giving your all for this thing. The Lord is going to give you his all, man. But if you come in this thing, and you half stepping, you, you know, you half fasting. What do you think the Lord going to do for you whenever you, you uh, need him right now? The Lord needs us. He said, who shall, um, 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 rise up for me against the evildoers. The Lord needs us right now. He said, Hey, go out there and, 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 and do my work. And Jake can't even do that. So don't be surprised when your ass getting, you know, shots, you know, f uh, on, 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 on fired in your vehicle. Okay, or, or you know, or even worse, just ju judgment is coming upon you. You thinking, oh, Lord, what do I, what do I do to deserve this? You see, hey man, are we coming into a time where you know all, all that shit about you know being a Hebrew Israelite, you know, it, it, it was real cute, man. You know, it was real cute then. But we coming into a time where it ain't gonna be cute no more. All right, verse seven. Every man according as he purposed in his heart. So he says, but he which soweth, lucky you. He which soweth bountifully shall reap also bountifully. So if a man sowing, you know, everything he got, you know, for you, how about you shine the spirit of this truth, man? He going to reap, you know, everything, if, um, you know, bountifully, man, greatly. You see, every man according as he purposed if in his heart. So let him give not grudgingly or of necessity of Yahweh Bashim for Shai loveth. A cheerful giver, and you should be given. The first thing you should be given is your time, your energy, and to, and to, and to this, this word, man. You see, and it's for your own good, man. Scripture says that wisdom and knowledge should be the stability of that of thy times. You see, if this man knew a time we, that, that we was in, he he would have been in a whole different spirit. He could have avoided all this, man. All this could have got avoided. You know, he could have you know stopped and um you know let 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 they ass out. You know. <laughs> Hey, some ain't right. Y'all hey, 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 go ahead and get out, man. It's, uh, some shit, you know, whatever it could, it could be, man. But this right here just go to show you that, hey, the times are getting worse, you know. And I keep doing videos on all this judgment going out. I got more videos I got I to gotta do of just judgment, just straight judgment going out, man. All right. So if you ain't, this don't put the fear in you to start seeking your whole boss and your shit. Because you got Jake out here. You know, you got Jake out here. You got so many brothers in this truth. You know, you you may be out here doing lift or doing DoorDash or, 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 or whatever you may have it, and the motherfucker start, may start sending shots at you. You could be driving down the road, and a motherfucker may have a road, road rage incident and send shots. This happened a lot too, but people have road rage incidents, and they're emptying clips in whole cars, man. Emptying clips in whole cars, or or, or emptying whole clips in cars. All right, so we in that time. Okay, we in that time. If you ain't if you if you can't see it by now, it's because you about to be in it, and you, and you about to be stranded, man. Okay, with no place, no place, no place to go, nobody to call upon. You ain't gonna know shit. All right, the end. Hey, Amen. <laughs> there, there you go. All right. So with that being said, the water you hold, Bashim, give me spirit, do this lesson. I pray this edifies the whole full leg scattered abroad. With that being said, I'm gonna say shalom.